priests and also of the Methodist Church in Tochimicholco, Puebla, Mexico, the ongoing medical dental ministry in Tochi has been happening their entire lives. But for those who participated in those first trips, what has transpired since November 1989 is almost miraculous. The first visit to Tochi was by a youth team in the summer of 1986 to tear down a damaged Adobe Methodist Church. The earthquake that hit Mexico City the year before left a congregation of a handful of people with an overwhelming job of demolishing and rebuilding. The teenagers of then First United Methodist Church amazed all those who knew it was impossible by accomplishing the demolition. Then three years later, a joint team from First Church and Dayspring Church in Tempe, Arizona, took the first medical team. The town was without resources and was at the end of a mountainous road that was at times treacherous. There was very little future opportunity and people lived a life of primarily primitive farming. The doctors and dentists working in buildings that weren't being used anymore or a family moved out while the team was there so their room could be used. Many of those buildings had large holes with views of the sky. Dental sterilization was with a pressure cooker. Medical rooms might have a horse tied outside and a herd of goats might be driven down the street at any time of day or pre-dawn. Toshimishoko is quite different now. A number of events brought new life in, including an eruption of the neighboring volcano in 1994, which caused the government to conscript laborers to build an exit road out of the other side of town. This road brought new life in. The medical clinic that was built because of support from the teams from Grace and Dayspring enabled people to get needed care. A dental clinic is there now as well. Some of the amazing results of a first team of teenagers going to a desolate town to help are these. Medical and dental clinics with a dormitory for teens. A church compound that includes the clinics, the church, a kitchen and dining room, showers and flush toilets. The beginning of a training program for community-based health workers by Give Ye Them to Eat a Methodist development project in Mexico, so far providing far more than 10,000 patients visits and education during the medical caravans. Discovery of high lead levels in children from pottery glaze and education about needed changes. Year-round doctor and dentist several days a week. At least 167 persons from Grace have participated in the medical missions plus three youth teams of another 50 persons. Over $110,000 has been given in medicine and construction help split between Grace and Dayspring. There have been over 17,000 medical consultations during medical caravans and at least 7,000 dental patients have been given care. Vacation Bible School has taught countless children about Jesus and God's love while their families experience that love through the care given by the medical dental teams. These are measurable effects of this church and our sister church working every year to bring care and medicine to people who struggle with harsh lives. The immeasurable effects include relationships between people of different cultures, an awareness of being brothers and sisters regardless of where we live, and churches on both sides of the border knowing God's grace and expanding their understanding of who we are in the world and what we stand for. Amen.